It's part of a composition called of mine called the Wild Wild West. Uh, played on a turkey. Terry's guitar is in pretty good shape. Uh, you can't really see where the neck has been worked on. Um, there's some buckle rash on the back. It didn't uh, really cut through the finish, but there are still some dents in there. The strap button is a part of the neck reset. And uh, I'm going to tune it to an open G and play it a little bit because I know what I'm doing more in the tuning. Composition of mine called the <clears throat> juxtaposition of the sinister and the sublime. Um, <clears throat> it's played in an open E tuning, but on the third, on the Terz guitar, it's now an open G. It's all in this book here. Um, books for sale and reverb. It's understanding open tunings. It's written by a true expert in the field. Um, anyway, let's do some things with this. Uh, I'm finger picking it. We'll take a pick off and see what happens next. Well, the little guitar was unplayable. Uh, and I uh, reset the neck as you would on a classical guitar by cutting between the heel and the body, re-angling and anchoring it with a pin. In this case, the pin is... Uh, disguised as the strap button. <laughs>
didn't get carried away on this little thing. You know, uh, Sting uh, started playing a Terz guitar, and if you saw him in interviews, he had it with him all the time. You can uh, get a good goodly amount of time in making it able to play at this level. Thank you.